Thank you so much for joining me today, my friends, for this reading. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share. I really appreciate all of the above. And I hope you enjoy your reading. Here we go. Hello, my Leo friends. It is Anna here. I've got my tarot, got my tea. And we are pulling some cards for the full moon we have coming up on Friday, July 23rd. So we're going to look at what my Leo friends need to release this full moon. What's the best thing for them to get? Get gone. Get it out. Oh. Okay. <laughs> As like eight cards splatter themselves all over my table. Let's try this again, my Leo friends. What do you need to release with this full moon? Hmm? What do my Leo friends need to let go of? That's four cards. Do I take it? I need four cards. No. All right, Leo, there we go. You know, two cups, that was one of the ones that fell out earlier. It's funny, that I noticed anyways. What are we transforming? Okay, and I'm not even getting the questions out now. They're like, Pfft. <laughs> All right, what's being illuminated or coming to light right now for my Leo friends? Let's see. What message does the universe have for you, my Leos? Okay, well, that's lots of messages. We just want one. <laughs> Let's try that again. All right. All right, my Leo friends, what do you need to release or let go of? And that is the Two of Cups. So there is perhaps a chance that you're involved with somebody right now, um, that there is a partnership of some kind. Um, I'm even going to go so far as to say it doesn't have to be like romantic involvement. It could be somebody who is like a business partner, you know, if there's nobody in your life who's who you're dating or married to or whatever the case may be that it could be um someone that you have some form of collaboration with and perhaps it's just a misunderstanding that you need to let go of however this is like a partnership so whether it's a relationship or something that is work related you either need to let go of a situation maybe forgive a situation or just let it go entirely all right transformation how are you going to reach your full potential and that is ten of wands and i am just going to say drop all those wands drop all that baggage you do not need to carry it with you my leo friends you do not need all of that weight um slowing you down okay you do not do not do not need that um the good thing about a 10 is that it's the end of the cycle Okay, so, so, you know, maybe sitting with those burdens and saying, you know, I know the reason why I have you. I know the reason why you are with me. I know why I feel a certain way about you, but it's time for me to let you go now. Perhaps you need to sit down um, in order to reach that full potential is to, yeah, get rid of burdens. I would never actually sit here and say, you know, reaching, reaching 
reaching your full potential is taking burdens on. Mm, I wouldn't go so far as to say that. Um, because especially when I'm looking at the next card and that, that is what is coming to light right now or being illuminated for you and it is the four of swords which is a card of rest and recovery okay the three of swords is literally a card of heartbreak and this is the aftermath right you're stitching your heart back together you're putting yourself you're picking up the pieces and putting yourself back together so you are you know settled into your nest here and you are not going anywhere you just need to take a moment for yourself and just rest, recover um, all the re's, right? Um, just retreat a little bit, have some solitude, right? Um, get yourself back in the mindset that, that you need to be in, right? Yes, that person hurt you. Yes, you had all these burdens and maybe some of them belong to that person okay maybe that's why it hurts so much because sometimes we do things for people and they haven't earned it and we just want to do it to be nice and we've all been there we've all done that my leo friends you know oh i just wanted to help them out that's great that's fine and dandy but they are not your burdens to carry okay and so you need to go back into your heart space and and just recover see that heart has like stitching on it can you see that it's got like stitches on it four in fact ha. all right and the universe's message for you my leo friends is the moon okay and the moon is all about things that they kind of look different from uh, a certain perspective okay the moon is about trusting your intuition because sometimes things don't look the way that they seem right sometimes there's two sides to things when you're in the water and you look up it's kind of wavy and nothing's ever really clear you can make out general shapes and colors however um what you're seeing might not actually be um what is there okay so be aware of some deceit perhaps from this person that you're carrying these burdens for and that you have to recover from okay um i yeah i see somebody in your life leo romantic or otherwise who you have carried things for and they have hurt you and you you still have these burdens because you took them on so they left them with you and now you need to recover okay but things aren't always what they seem they look different in different perspectives so they probably have no idea that they've done this to you <laughs> they they often don't do they they often don't they don't understand their actions we've all had one of those all right my leo friends i hope you have an amazing full moon on friday and that this video finds you well and we will touch base soon bye for now